what is going on guys and welcome to the channel and today we have a tutorial for you guys for how to bypass iCloud activation lock so if you have an iPhone that is locked by iCloud when you are activating it and you can't seem to bypass that screen today we have a working method that will work very easily across all different uh, regions and areas and this is free and an awesome tutorial so as long as you follow along with these steps and you will be able to get the exact same iCloud bypass so to begin it's going to start when you are at your activation screen and also note that this tutorial does work for iOS 10 and 11 and so it does not matter if you're on the iOS 11 beta or just up to the latest version of iOS 10 either way this method will work hundred percent guaranteed anyway so to begin if you're on iOS 10 like I am um, then you are going to want to first connect to your Wi-Fi network and then make sure that you uh, click the home button after you connect and then click more Wi-Fi settings and then the the little I should pop up to the right of the Wi-Fi network after that comes up hit the little I button and then click forget network now once you've forgotten the network but I still have access to that screen that has all the advanced details now we, we are going to scroll into the empty DNS box there's lots of other options on the screen but all we need is a DNS now I'm going to put all the DNS addresses on screen as well as in the description below so that you guys can see exactly which one to use for your area now I'm in the USA so I'm going to type mine in and it's 104.154.51.7 so after I fill this out then I am going to go ahead and make sure that it is the correct IP for the region that we're in and once we have that then we're going to go ahead and click back and now we're going to type in the Wi-Fi password and connect now once we are connected then it's going to try to activate the iPhone now from that point on just click the back button in the top left corner go back to the Wi-Fi setup and then a few seconds later a prompt should just pop up without you having to press or do anything at all it should automatically come up and then once that comes up then you have reached the bypass now this bypass is made by iHacks and this is basically a server that is ran to simulate um, iOS 11 now this is obviously not the full version of iOS and you're not going to get the full iOS experience however this is a very capable working bypass that will still get you a lot of features that you can find in the normal iPhone anyways once we reach this main menu here then we are going to go ahead and click menu and explore on what we can see here um, that there is on this phone so as you guys can see with this iCloud bypass server then there are now a ton of websites applications games and all that stuff so there's social media there are different applications that you can run um, there are games that are actually built into the server such as Flappy Bird and much much more that you guys can just scroll through and play these games all without even having to download them as it's all run on a server that you are connected to aside from that then there's also much much more um, there's social media websites and while it's not the full app it will just direct you to the website for example if you go to Twitter it will take you to mobile Twitter um, there's also video and audio applications so there's YouTube on here there's Spotify SoundCloud and much much more and overall there is just a lot that you can do here within this little iOS uh, iCloud bypass and while you won't get the full iOS experience it still is a very very good working alternative to anyone who is uh, in dire need to get past the iCloud screen um, but you either don't know the password or um, there's just no way to connect to it as long as you have Wi-Fi and are in a good area that you can connect to this DNS server then you will be good to go and you will be able to get some functionality out of your iPhone even if it's locked is not even accessible to the full iOS screen so that is going to wrap up this tutorial guys let us know down below if you did follow along with this method and if you are enjoying the iCloud bypass that's going to do it leave a thumbs up if you did enjoy the video and we will catch you guys in the next one see ya